Have you ever tried migrating Canvas apps or cloud flows across sites or tenants? You probably already know that this is a painfully slow and manual process. The issue here is that the exported packages point to the original SharePoint sites, lists, and views. As a result, after an import, you have to seek every single reference to the original site and point them to a new site. It's not a problem if your flow or an app is relatively simple. But imagine you have a large Canvas app, or even worse, you have multiple apps and flows to migrate. Apart from the sheer waste of time, these manipulations are error-prone. This is how you typically upgrade your flow after an import. You have to manually correct every single action in the flow. Flow and Power Apps Migrator takes all of your exported flows and apps and converts them to be compatible with the target environment. This is a huge time saver that also reduces migration-related mistakes. Now, let me show you how to use the Flow and Power Apps Migrator. First, let's download the latest release of the Flow and Power Apps Migrator package from this page. Extract the zip package anywhere on your computer. Now, put all of your exported flows and apps in the source folder. The Flow and Power Apps Migrator script will iterate through all zip files inside the SRC directory and convert them to be compatible with the new Microsoft 365 tenant or site. Before moving on, Make sure your target SharePoint site already has the same lists and libraries as the source site. You can use a migration tool or simply create them manually. Alternatively, you can use the move list script. Now, double click the migrate packages batch file. It will prompt you to log in first to the original site and then to the target site. Then sit back and wait until it's done. Now, navigate to the disk folder and collect your converted flows and apps. Finally, go ahead and import your flows and apps to the destination tenant. You'll notice that all SharePoint references are now converted and point to the new location. If you have any tips or tricks for migrating flows and apps, please share them in the comments section below.